this is Jeffrey T. And I get a lot of questions all the time, so I just start by answering some of those. Uh, first one, uh, people a lot of times ask me, well, how do you get saved? How are you saved? And uh, you can go and you can look at Romans 10, 9, you know, if you confess with your mouth and believe that uh, in your heart that Jesus is Lord. Okay. Also, you look at John 3, 16, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. If you believe that Jesus was born of a virgin, God incarnate, uh, came here to pay for your sins, uh, was died, buried, resurrected from the dead, and uh, if you're believing that and you're trusting in him as your sacrifice for salvation, then you are saved. Uh, that's good news. That's good news. Now, the promises of God, uh, you have to activate those, and we do that by doing the Word. When we read the Word and we do it, we see it uh, manifest in our lives. But as far as our salvation, we are not looking at our own, our own obedience. We're looking at the obedience of Christ, as it says in Corinthians. Every thought captive to the obedience of Christ. As when I mess up and that kind of thing, I can say, Oh, thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. That it's not my obedience you're looking at, but you're looking at Jesus' obedience. I'm with him. I believe what he did. We praise the Lord. Thank you. Y'all have a great day.